Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rake, and welcome to a 1.17.1 Let's Play series, but this time we're doing it on Amplified. So if you're wondering why I'm starting a, a new series, uh, the reason why is because unfortunately I messed up big time. And uh, if you did not see my previous video or any of my community posts, well, unfortunately, I accidentally uh, deleted all my worlds. So if you go here, as you can tell, as soon as I click on single player, there's no worlds there to be seen. So that means I've lost like all my test build worlds, everything, even all my let's play worlds, my stream worlds, all of them. So today we're going to be starting a, a new world. So we're going to be playing on survival. And I'm going to put that to hard. Uh, more game world options. Is it here? Yes, it is. There we go. Amplified. OK, so uh, I'm not going to select a seed. Uh, maybe actually I will. I'll name it. Sorry. There we go. <laughs> All right. So let's create a new world and uh, let's hop right into this and see where we spawn. All right. So we are in. Oh, actually, let's start off by uh, turning off the cloud. So is it video settings? Quality? Where's the clouds? Where are the clouds? Oh, I didn't want to do that. Um, I don't know. Where are the clouds? Uh, details, maybe? Fog start. We can turn fog off. Oh no. How do you do that? Alright, well, that doesn't matter. We need to get rid of the clouds. Default, fast, fancy, off. There we go. Alright, so. Where have we spawned? Uh, looks like, okay, like, oh, there's some spruce over there, actually, which is really good. Oh, I got auto jump on, guys. Look at that. <laughs> I've exactly reset my whole Minecraft as well. So we've got a snowy biome over there, it looks like, with some spruce, which is good, so we can get a bunch of spruce wood going. Um, oh, there's a bumblebee, look at that. Anything else around here? Uh, I don't know, I think I might go and get some spruce saplings though to get started, so then we can uh, always grow some more spruce trees. And I kind of would like to find a village, because these villages in these worlds can spawn really, really cool. Alright, so actually before we get down from here, let's grab a bunch of wood as usual. This is what we need for uh, the start of our world. We're going to need to get some tools going. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to this because unfortunately I wanted to... Uh, well, I was always uh, wanted to play on my Amplified world from my 100 days because it's really fun. So uh, this is going to be another chance to, to relive that a little bit. Because I kind of was uh, looking forward to building that village in that like kind of ravine area. But yeah, hopefully we can do something similar in this world. So I'm just going to grab a bunch of wood and then I'm going to get some cobblestone, get some tools going and then uh, I'm going to go collect some spruce saplings and then we're going to head out. Alright, so this is going to be the hard part now guys. We need to make it across there. Oh, uh, this is not going to be fun. It's going to be really, really hard at the beginning to try to move around everywhere. But I'm hoping that we can do it quite easily. Is there any water anywhere? There's one little water source right there. But we need some more. I wish there was some iron up here, but it doesn't spawn this high, unfortunately. Uh, yeah, there's a little pool here. Uh, can we go down that way? Oh, actually, looks like we might be able to. And there is some spruce trees down there as well. All right, let's try to get down there safely. Ouch, <laughs> not like that. And then I, was, I wanted to go that direction. So let's go get some wood, if I can get down. Can we get down? Uh, all right, we can jump on these trees. Go down slowly. There we go. Okay, uh, a little bit lower down. All right, so we made it. All right, so let's collect some trees. Such as check if there's anything around here. Oh, we need to get some food as well. Really badly, actually. All right, well, let's just collect some wood for now. Uh, we could actually go grab some of those berries. I think I might do that. Let's go grab some of those berries. Look at that. It's insane, the generation in this. It's really, really fun to play. All right, so yeah, I'm going to grab some trees, get some food, and then we're going to head over... Uh, to the direction, well, just over there, just over spawn, pretty much, so let's go do that. Alright, so we've got plenty of berries here, and some sugar cane, actually, so we're going to take that, take all of these berries as well. There we go. How many berries is that? Alright, alright, it's already ten, so that's good. Uh, anything else? Oh, there's a massive waterfall over there, I think. Let's go check that out. Well, it's not the direction I wanted to originally go, but we can... Oh, there's an enderman, and I almost looked at it. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at all those mobs there. So many mobs. There's two endermen as well. I don't think it's actually that hard to get ender pearls in Amplified either. So they tend to spawn everywhere. Um, there we go. Grab all of this. Oh, we are in uh, 1.17 as well. So we should have all the mobs, I'm hoping. Uh, I've never played it yet on this. So this is going to be a, a new little adventure. Let's go check over here. There might be some uh, goats, actually. Hopefully, anyway. 
Actually, I wanted to go this direction, but I don't think I will because it's just birch trees and I'm not the biggest fan of uh, just birch, like birch forests. So we're going to go back over to this direction because there was a like normal forest. So hopefully we can find some cool stuff over there. I am really, really hoping for a village. So let's go check out over this direction and I'll get back to you guys if we find something cool. Oh, there's a sheep. Let's get all these animals. Hopefully we can get a few more sheep so we can sleep the night. Because I don't want to have to run around in the amplified... Uh, any more sheep? Just one? Seriously? It's a bunch of piggies. I can hear another pig. Any more sheep? Anywhere? Oh, I guess not. Where was that? Oh, it's just a cave. With a bunch of mobs again. Alright, let's not go that way. Let's go this way instead where it's nice and bright. I did hear that pig though. Where was he? Where are you, Mr. Piggy? I don't hear you anymore. Did you run away? Where are you? I can hear you somewhere. Are you on top of me? Or underneath me? Oh, there you are. There we go. Alright, let's keep heading this direction and I hope to find something cool. Alright, so it is getting night time and I've got two wool but not three. Is there none around at all? Any sheep? There's some pigs over there. Uh, Alright, one over there. Quick, quick, quick. We need to get there really quickly. Oh, we're not going to get there in time. This is not good. I kind of want to live close to this area because it's nice and flat. So if we do... Oh, there's a ravine now, I think. So that is good. Yeah, because there's loads of caves and we're kind of low, like, for, like, to the good height. Yeah, and we're kind of low because we're at the good height for caves to actually spawn. Because if you're too high, they don't spawn. Um, all right, come on, Mr. Sheep. Oh, there's two here. There we go. Uh, I need to do this quickly. There we go. Place step down. Get the bed going. There we go. Plonk that down. All right, go to sleep. Nice. Oh, I need to change my chat size as well. That is way too big. <laughs> yeah, all right, good. So that was our first night. Well, we didn't spend a lot of time, to be honest, though, and no mobs spawned, which is actually really good. Um, anything else around? It? Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Look at this, guys. Oh, that is dangerous area. I thought there was a lot more mobs, to be honest, but still. Um, I don't know which direction to go. I think I might keep going this direction over here. I was really hoping to find a village, but we might not. We might just have to settle down somewhere else. There's a lot of caves here. There's a ravine there. What's this? Alright, there's another cave there. Oh, where is it? It goes down pretty deep. There's some copper down there. I don't even see any iron. Unless that was iron right there. Oh, I think that's iron there. Hmm. Right, I don't particularly want to go down into a ravine right now. So, let's just keep looking for a little uh, house location. Hopefully, we'll find one pretty close by. So, I've got to keep going this direction over here. Let's see if we can find anything cool. Oh, look at that. A little baby pig. I never really see them spawn. Oh, I didn't, I didn't mean to kill your, your parents. I'm sorry. But I did. Guys, don't you think that um, pigs should drop leather as well? I think they should. Or like a hide or so, like a variant where, where you can uh, still make like books or something with them. Or even armor. Oh, there's a cow there and one here. Talk about leather. There's a few cows, actually. All right, I'm going to get most of the cows I can because I've got a feeling it's going to be a pain to get some leather. Especially with the, the like the like where they spawn all these mobs, they kind of struggle a bit sometimes. But yeah, all right, this place is actually kind of cool. I do like it. Maybe we could build near here. Oh wow, there's a swamp. I've never seen a swamp in Amplified. Oh, and there's a there's a portal there, the abandoned portal or a ruined portal. That's it, a ruined portal. That's what I was trying to say. Um, I wanted to climb up to the top here so I could see if there's anything close by. I can always pop my render distance up as well. So let's get up to the top here. I need to cook some food as well. Because I keep trying to eat my berries, but I accidentally place them down. Hmm. Is that like a snow biome, I'm guessing? There's some pumpkins down there. A bunch of cows. There's a portal there, which I don't see a chest, actually. Anything else? Alright, let me turn my render distance up, actually. Uh, where is it? Video settings. Let's get some lag going. There we go. Oh, actually, well, it doesn't look like we're lagging. Anything? Go on, render in. So, some more mountains over there. I've not seen any goats. Any goats? Nope, no goats. Alright, well, yeah, it doesn't look like there's much, actually. Oh, look at that. There's a witch's hut over there. <laughs> oh, and there's a plains, actually. I kind of, I want to go down there now. I didn't want to go down at first because it's always hard to get back up in Amplified. 
But I think we can go down there. We can go loot that portal, get some lily pads, go kill some cows as well. And then also, there is a plane. So we can go to the plains over there. I've never tried to make a witch farm, so maybe we could do that in this series. First, let me cook up some food, though. And once we have cooked up a little bit of food, we are going to head down there. All right, getting down from this place is not easy at all. I really don't like traveling in Amplified without an Elytra. It's a lot easier when you've got an Elytra. Um, where are we? Oh, we fell down. There we go. Almost at the bottom. Oh, I almost went a little bit too far there. Can we get down from here? There we go. One here. Oh, the damage. Taking so much damage. And there is a Enderman that I almost looked at. There are all those squid in there. I wish they were glow squid. It would have been a lot better. Seeing glow squid on our first episode, that'd be really cool. All right. Uh, I'm going to get a bit of lag though now, guys, because my render distance is pretty high because I'm just trying to look for somewhere. Um, anything over here? So just swamp ready. It's a baby sheep as well, did I just hear? Oh, yeah, look at that. So two baby animals we just seen already. Um, where's the chest? Oh, here it is. We got a efficiency five shovel and some glycerine melon, some nine nuggets. I should take it all, I guess. Apart from the pressure plate, uh, we're not going to take everything. There we go. There is no gold block, though. It's a bit annoying. All right, never mind. All right, let's go and check out the... Oh, no, we want to get some cows, didn't we? So let's go kill some cows, and then uh, I'll get back to you guys once we reach the other side of the swamp. All right, guys, I just slept over here because I thought these were sheep, but they're not. <laughs> they're goats. Look at them. Oh, don't want to fall in. Oh, that vine almost made me fall in. So I thought we need to make a boat anyway to get across the, the little bit of water that there is. So let's try to get the goat in the boat for that achievement. Come on. Yay, there we go. <laughs> we got it. Whatever floats your goat. <laughs> All right, well, I'm not going to take you with me, though, because it's going to be too hard. Actually, no, we can maybe go this way. No, we can't. All right. Sorry, buddy, but you're going to have to stay here on your own. All right, let's grab our uh, crafting table. And let's go ahead over to there, because that's where the um, oh, witch's hut is, over there. Is there a brewing stand in there? I think there is. Uh, so I might go take that as well. Hello, Mr. Goat. Okay, it doesn't look like there is a village nearby. I've been searching for a while now. Actually, how far have we been? Uh, probably like a thousand blocks. In Amplified, that's quite a lot of distance. But I do kind of like this area. Like, these hills over here look pretty good. Is this a flower for us? It is as well. Oh, that is awesome. Oh, and there's some horses here. Look at that. we got some uh, weird-shaped uh, floating island up there. But I haven't checked over here. And we do have the swamp. It's just, like, over there. Just behind that mountain right there. We have some snow biome over there. And we have a little normal forest over here. Oh, I thought I saw something crawling. I thought I saw... A village, but I don't think I did actually. Is that there's more horses over there? Oh, there's some cows. Oh, we got a dark oak forest as well. Yeah, I kind of like this area. I think this is where we're gonna live, so we have to get rid of you though. Actually, I won't kill all of you because we might need some of them. Uh, but yeah, let me just check around this corner and we'll see what's there. And if not, we'll just go back over to there and uh, we're gonna go start on uh, building our first base. Well, I say that, but we might actually want to get some iron going as soon as possible as well. So that could come in handy. And we do need a bit of cobblestone. So, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do that. We'll do a bit of mining and then uh, we'll start on the build. All right, look at this river, guys. It's kind of cool. Uh, I did go uh, onto this side now, but there's nothing over there. It's just some more dark oak. But I, I thought this is a pretty cool area here. Oh, hopefully we don't hit the lava there. Oh, no. Wait, is this a cave? There's an axolotl! Oh, no! Oh, he's killing the uh, the squid. All right, don't die on me, buddy. All right, we need to get some iron as soon as possible. Oh, we won't be able to get him. I don't think he might despawn. Unless there's some iron down here. Anything? There is a cave. We're not too far from him. Please don't despawn. Come on, stay here. Oh, there's my boat. I need to get that. All right, let me go check in this cave here, see if there's any iron. We just need a little bit of iron. Just a teeny bit. Oh, I think that I think that's iron right there. All right, let me craft a um, door. There we go. Go down. Oh, actually, let me get, get a bit more air. Where is he gone? I hope he's not gone. Is he gone? 
No, I thought I thought he was drowning, but it was uh, him killing a uh, <laughs> another squid, I think. All right, let's go here. Okay, where is that iron? All right, let me in. There we go. Oh, he killed a glow squid. I didn't even notice. All right, I did not see it was a glow squid, though. Am I getting the iron? Wait, I got iron on me. Oh, I'm so silly. We got some um, nuggets. I don't know if that's going to be enough, though, to actually make a bucket. Ah, oh, it's not. We're short one. Seriously. All right. Let's grab this iron. We can get it. Wait, I just got myself stuck. All right. Get out of here quick. There we go. All right. I know you guys can't see much right now. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. But we can smelt some of this iron up. There we go. Where's it, Axolotl? I don't see it anymore. Where is it? Oh, you're not going to tell me it despawned. Seriously? Wait, it despawned? Oh no. Axolotl, where are you? Oh, there's someone here. Oh, it's night time. Um, okay, this is getting a bit hectic now, just for an Axolotl. All right, let me, um, let me go to sleep quickly. There we go. We don't want mobs killing us here. And actually, we can leave the bed here as well. There we go. Alright, where is my crafting table? Over here. This is so hectic. Alright, a bucket. There we go. Grab some water. And you come here. No. No. Yeah, got you. There we go. The cutest predator. That is true. 100%. Alright, that was awesome. So, I guess the... Oh, there's another glow squid. Look at that. Oh, let's go see that quickly. So, I'm guessing that a bunch of axolotls and glow squids will be spawning in here. That is awesome. That is so, so cool. Look at him. He looks so cool. Oh, I'm going to drown soon. Oh, they make sound. I don't, did not know that. All right, let's cook up some of our food in here. I know we're underground, but hey. Let's grab this iron as well. We need it. I can reach it. There we go. Yeah, I did not know um, that the glow squids actually made sound. I thought they are like a normal squid where they don't make any sound at all. They do look really cool, especially right next to a normal squid. Look at that. Oh, I can't see it now. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm going to cook up some food and then uh, I'm just going to climb to the top because we don't want to live in this cave. Uh, we could actually, but no, we're not going to do that. We're going to have a nice cliff house because that's the point of the amplified uh, terrain. So let me go check over here. Yeah, look at this guy. Look at him. He's all shiny. Look at you. You're all pretty. Look at you. All right, now, how are we going to get up there, though? Oh, wow, look at this place, guys. This is so cool. Uh, I've got a feeling we're going to have to build our house here <laughs> because this is looking really cool. And we're in the flower forest. Oh, this, look at this. This looks awesome. This looks really, really cool. I, need to, I want to find a nice flat uh, spot on the mountain here. All right, this place needs to be lit up, though. Let's go back up here. Where, could, where should we build it? Alright, so I did choose a location. Uh, as you can tell, uh, it's right here. Uh, in this beautiful like little cave area. And I thought we can build it into this wall right here. Hang on, let me jump down. There we go. So yeah, like into this wall right here. I want That's what I want to do. So a nice little starter house. Not too complicated because we have been going for quite a while now. Trying to look for this location. And it's right next to where that axolotl spawned. So actually talking about the axolotl. Uh, I need a name for it guys. So uh, leave some of your name suggestions in the comments. And we'll be naming it next episode. And uh, yeah. Alright, so let's start digging. Oh wow. This efficiency 5 is going to break instantly. <laughs> look at the health. Look at the hell for this thing. It's already almost gone. It's halfway there. Alright, well, so I'm going to mine down a little bit. I don't want to go too far down. But uh, just uh, just enough so that we're at the perfect height and we have plenty of room to actually build. So I'm going to be uh, getting all this coal later, don't worry. So for now though, we're going to keep going down a little bit. And I kind of also want to try to use some copper in this Let's Play. It's kind of a hard block to build with. But uh, I also want to try to get a charged creeper because if I'm not mistaken, it's pretty easy to get a charged creeper with this. So we'll have to give that a go. Alright, so guys, as you can tell, I have cleared out a big area right here. And this is where our house is going to be. 
a little starter house. But don't worry, uh, next episode or the episode after that, I'm not too sure yet. We're going to be building a pretty decent sized build. It's just that uh, we do not have a lot of resources right now. As you can tell, we're still with stone tools. Uh, I did get quite a bit of cobblestone actually as well. And we do have a bunch of smelting up up here. So we've got uh, like two stacks of think pretty much. Yeah, two stacks I am smelting up. But for now, uh, I did also plant some spruce saplings over there. Hopefully they'll grow soon enough. Uh, but for now though, let's get started on the build. Not gonna lie, I have no idea how I want to build this. So I was thinking of having a block like that in the corner. Hmm, it might need to be a little bit higher actually, the window. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, let's do this actually. Oh, actually, uh, we could do... Should we do this on the bottom? Now, I'm trying to think like, if I want the beam on the bottom part here or should I just have it directly like this? There we go. Oh, we're going to need a um, a uh, axe actually pretty soon because if not, we're going to be using this up pretty quickly. Well, it's going to be hard to actually mine is what I'm trying to say. Uh, so like that. And then we can have a little bit higher. Yeah, I think we can do that. All right, let's, uh, let's go up a little bit higher. So about one, two. No, we have to go one more. All right, let's go up one more. There we go. Do the same on here. So one, two. We'll have to mine this out a little bit more. That one is the third one. Get rid of that, that, and that. And now we go across. There we go. Can't shift. If not, I can't place it. Just don't want to fall all the way across. And how's that looking? That is symmetrical, I believe. Yes, it is. They will add some detail on the outside to make it less square. Because right now, I do not like the fact that it looks so square. Um, what else could we do? We could add we could add some lanterns on it and stuff like that. But for now, let's actually go craft up some trapdoors. Hey, who would have thought? All right, so let's craft some trapdoors quickly. Uh, there we go. Let's craft all these into trapdoors. Oh, didn't mean to do that. There we go. Okay. So... Where can we place a trapdoor? We can place one here. If I, oh, I need to stop shifting. There we go. We can do the same on here. And one up there. And one here. Alright, that gives it a bit more detail. We could always... Well, actually, we'll have to get some glass panes as well to add in the centre here. Hmm. All right. Well, for now, that will do. I don't want to spend too much uh, time on the outside of this. I do want to spend a bit more time decorating the inside. So I think we can make it look pretty nice. So actually, let me give it a bit more room here and then I'll get back to you guys once I've mined this out. OK, so I've gone ahead and uh, crafted up uh, a few stairs and some slabs and I also chopped down one of the big trees. So now we should have a bunch of wood that we can actually use. So I wanted to make some staircases up here to make like a bedroom. Uh, don't worry, this will not be a <laughs> massive doorway that big. All right, so let's go up a little bit more. Maybe one more. Hmm. Kind of. I think we need to keep it like pretty low though. It's only going to be for the bedroom. Oh, actually, hang on. This ain't going to be that good. We might have to move this staircase back one more. I think we will. All right, so let's do that. There we go. So we have a, a floor up here. We'll have the bedroom. Okay, uh, let's grab a few more slabs, actually. There we go. Oh, didn't want to do that. There we go. All right, so we've got 18 more slabs. That should do the trick. Bring that across. I don't want it to be a big bedroom, so actually what we could do is get rid of that. Get one of these. Oh, actually, should we, do it? should we do it here? I think we might do it here. So we'll do that. And then we could have a beam going across. But then it gets a bit low, doesn't it? Hmm. Uh, no, I don't think we'll do that. We'll just do some more slabs. We can do like maybe some staircases like that. Oh, not that, but like that. Break that one and place it upside down. There we go. What we could do is actually add some s uh, trap doors. There we go. Gives it a bit more detail. This can be a loot room or like a chest room. Yeah, we can fit in six chests there, so that should be good. All right, so then up here we could bring that up one more. There we go. All right, now, yeah, we'll, we'll have to bring this uh, back one more. Well, actually, no, we might not. Um, what we can do is use up some of this stone here. So let's go down here. Make some... I don't know what I'm crafting here. I want to do some bricks. 
There we go. Some more bricks. Then some stairs. So four should do the trick. Now, I've, I've still got my copper on me, which I don't need. Uh, what we can do is do... Hmm. Not sure, actually, if that will work. No, all right. Yeah, we'll, we'll have to bring the stairs back one. All right, well, for now, let's leave that. Now, let's continue on the inside here. So up here will be the bedroom. We'll have uh, the, a fence going across here. Then we can actually break this as well. Let's place a torch here for now. Then we'll have a wall here. Then we just go here. You can walk down. And then what we can do is have our loot room here. So we're going to break the floor here as well. There we go. Actually, just place some of these here. Uh, there we go. I don't know why, but I just want to use copper on the floor here at the entrance. We'll see. We'll see, actually. Uh, we'll need somewhere to cook some of our stuff so we can have like a little indent in the wall here where we'll have our little cooking station so let's do that oh okay so that's gonna be a bit of a problem uh, unless I grab some of these there we go all right so yeah we'll have that there there we go let's do the trick uh, what we can do is actually add some of our stairs here there we go and one more I'll just grab one of these for now. There we go. Place that there. All right, so we'll have our furnaces here. We'll have our crafting table there as well. So that's a that's, that should be plenty uh, for furnaces. And here, though, I did want to add a trapdoor and one here as well. We'll have to replace this wall with some stuff on it, add a bit of detail in there. So we can use a bit of spruce maybe and some bricks. But for now though, I'm going to actually change this floor out, so I'll get back to you guys once I've done that. Alright, so guys, as you can tell, I've done a little bit more work off camera. So I've added in, uh, we've got some chests here, so we've got all our stuff in here. We have a little workstation right here, and we have this massive window, which needs to be decorated on the outside. Which I'll be doing off camera once I've ended off this episode. But for now, what we can do is add in our glass panes. Hopefully there we got enough. Oh, we do. We have plenty. All right, so let's place them all the way over here. There we go. Go all the way around. If I can reach. There we go. On the bottom as well. Now I have to get the center without messing up, please. I don't want to waste any glass. There we go. One more. All right, good. All right, so we got it. Look at that. It's a pretty cozy house. I also did move the, um, well, my bed, as you can tell, but I mean the stairs here as well. So I moved these back one more. Uh, now, though, uh, that is pretty much it, I guess. There's not too much more to do. So, guys, don't forget that you need to give me some name suggestions for our yellow axolotl right here. Uh, I was going to place them down, but no, I'll, it'll probably die or something, and I don't want that to happen. But yes, uh, we did also get some uh, ink sacks, which uh, will come in handy, I believe. Where are... I don't see any of my leather. Uh, hello? The leather? Maybe I put it in the food chest? Alright, I did. Oof, scared me there. I thought I didn't have any leather left. Uh, I do need to get some iron for next episode so we can get some lanterns going. But for now, we can have a little sleep before we end off the episode. So, yeah, anyway, guys, I hope you did enjoy that episode. If you did, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll be seeing you in the next video. Peace.